Hello everybody, welcome to learn Mandarin from scratch. Today we are going to learn some most ancient Chinese characters. Xiang Xing Zi. Okay? Let's have a look at this. Xiang Xing Zi. Xiang Xing Zi. Xiang Xing Zi is uh, derived from pictures, you know. Um, these characters are the most ancient characters in Chinese and uh, about 4% of the Chinese characters are Xiang Xingzi. Okay? There are two characters here. The first one is yeah, the sun. In Chinese, the pronunciation is Ri. Okay, the second one is the moon. In Chinese, Yue. Yue. As you have noticed, these two characters are basically from the picture of the sun and the moon. Right? Okay, let's have a look at more characters like this. Xiang Xing Zi. Here, yeah. The first one, Ri. Ri means the sun. The second one, Yue. Yue means the moon. Okay? Okay, more characters. Okay, on this page we have two another characters. Also Xiang Xing Zi. The first one is fire. Hua Hua. Just notice this character is you know uh, very similar to this picture, right? Okay, the second one Mu means wood. Mu. Mu. Okay. It's also you know very like the picture. The first part are the branches of the tree, and the you know the below below part are the roots of the tree. Okay. Let's see next page. Before this, practice the pronunciation, okay? Hua, Hua, Mu, Mu. Okay. Here we have, uh, you know, the most important basic things for our life or for the earth. Shui means water. Just notice this picture. The water is flowing. But in Chinese, when people write this character, they just rotate this picture. You know, rotate to left. And then we got a picture like this, you know, uh, in the right hand side of this page and then the people change the, the picture to the character Shui Shui means water okay Shui Shui okay more yeah mountains Shan 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 Mountain Okay More This one is a little bit uh, hard for people to understand This character means the earth or the soil Just notice there is um, Soil 
on the ground and then you know on the right side is the transform of this character first people just draw a round and a line that means there is a you know um, a soul on the ground and then this character keep to chain changing finally we got this character like this to yeah like this okay hope you can understand it better now to it's a very you know basic you know uh, character in tennis because many characters have this part to okay just remember this Okay, let's have more. Yeah, this one is a little you no know, complicated, but I think yeah, maybe easy for understanding. The character means gold or metal. The pronunciation is Jin Jin Yeah Jin in the picture there is uh, an arrow you know arrow made by metal you no know? so this one is actually from the arrow okay chin chin okay this means gold or metal chin this one ship yeah, this character is, uh, you know, very like the head of a sheep. Yeah, right. The pronunciation is yang, yang, yeah, yang. Okay. You know, my last family name <laughs> actually is yang. Yeah, the pronunciation is the same, but the character is not. Okay. <laughs> Let's see next. This one it means few. Few. Just see these squares, you know, on the ground, and the people plant things in all these, you know, squares. This means few. And the, the pronunciation is Tian 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 Yeah, this means field. Okay, Tian Tian Okay, Tian Okay. Yes, yeah, thank you everybody. This is all for our lesson today. And I hope you can enjoy your lesson today and uh, we will meet next time. Okay, bye bye.